Returning to Coin Lady Channel, I am pleased to see you again. Everyone is wondering if we have hit rock bottom in regards to XRP. It appears like there was complete silence. Things, however, are always coming together in the background. We'll examine the current situation with XRP in light of some intriguing news from various nations and an intriguing price projection for the future. Is this the low before the surge in Bitcoin, XRP, and a plethora of other altcoins begins? And I'd like to address a common question, is it worthwhile to hold on to XRP? Has the peak slipped our minds? And most importantly, is it worth it to hang on to these coins? After much discussion on the channel, we now know that the SEC has reversed its position and wants $2 billion returned, yet, we remain optimistic about what's to come. People still keep XRP because they are tremendously bullish, because it is just one statement or decision away from completely soaring. In fact, I rank it among the top 10 cryptocurrencies that are actively working to address a pressing global issue at the moment. So, what exactly does that imply? In the end, XRP will facilitate the smooth flow of funds between various parties using the blockchain, including investors, institutions, and others. A major player in this bull run is XRPL, which I have already mentioned. That reality is still something I stand by. Despite a 2.5% gain yesterday, the market has had a very large drop once again. We are entering the new week with a pessimistic outlook since all of that has faded. The 50 cent threshold may soon be reclaimed, though, by XRP. Just what is going on here? After a whale invested heavily, acquiring a substantial 30 million XRP tokens, the XRP community was agog with enthusiasm. The altcoin's price, which had recently fallen, recovered enough to correspond with the large purchase. As a result, whales are still making purchases deep underwater. Just the other day, we witnessed this with Bitcoin on my livestream. I find it fascinating that the German government has been selling a lot of Bitcoin, both on disclosure and over-the-counter, lately. However, the market was so devastated by it that, guess what? They began purchasing it again at the bottom. Institutions, large corporations, and even nations are considering selling their Bitcoin holdings, which is something we certainly hope doesn't happen. It has been quite a roller coaster, but XRP may be poised to turn around. In addition to whales purchasing in as the price starts to rise, this 30 million tokens are one of several important catalysts that might help the story along. The sum of $12.7 million is quite substantial, and it is the result of just one transaction. Everything with SEC is currently decided upon at the settlement level, as I mentioned before. The geology department at Brad Garland House can offer their opinion on a variety of subjects. People are definitely hedging their bets, but in the end, it's up to Gary Gensler and his friends to decide on the penalties. Personally, I think it's a 50-50, and I've stated it before. If the settlement goes our way, we're off to the races, but it might also go the other way, you can buy an XRP right now. Time will tell if XRP takes a major damage, but as I mentioned before, we can expect to see an increase in the number of bull movements buying this coin in the future, and it seems like we're getting closer and closer to hearing that pronouncement from Judge Annalisa Torres. Check out the pricing right this second. A little dip for Bitcoin now that XRP has broken down below this lower support at 4,681, the MACD is showing a negative trend and the RSI is trending in the oversold region, furthermore, the price is trading at 42. We did manage to break down the bottom support, so it's possible that this reversal is happening again. There are a few more steps to go, though, if you zoom out again. If it were $1, it would be 35 cents, a little higher, at 38 cents, or, more critically, where we are now, at about 40 cents. So, there are some important things to watch for with XRP. However, a lot of individuals are really enthusiastic on XRP and think its price will go up a lot. I wanted to share some fascinating price forecasts from Coinpedia with you all. According to their projections, there might be a new chairman in 2024, and the price could even go over 70 cents if there is a bullish breakout and trend lines align beyond that level. 
As the new breakout begins, buyers have the power to push the price of Ripple to the psychological $1 level. It doesn't stop there, though, potential highs of $2.23 are still within reach. As I've mentioned before, I believe that, depending on the outcome of that settlement news, we will witness a very explosive XRP. More crucially, the narrative it enters depends on how far out into the future we are talking, those who are considering 2025 to 338 as a possible all the way to 2030, $16.25 are talking utter nonsense. We don't know where the cryptocurrency market is headed, but if you play out our vision for XRP's future, it could lead to cross-border payments, institutional adoption, and kin systems using it. The list goes on and on, and it's definitely possible. However, there are some things that need to happen right now like the settlement and getting his case stopped selling from escrow. There needs to be a lot more development on the XRPL, which could unlock a significant market move. And we don't expect a final run-up to retest the $72,000 Bitcoin price this week. But hey, I think it's likely. As always, I'd love to hear your thoughts on XRP in the comments section. What I truly want is for you to give me a story that is fascinating. Will you be raising your purchase price? How about you subscribe to my channel and give it a like? Going to miss you shortly.